turbocharged 51 over here. I hope you're having a splendid day wherever you are in the world. Guys, I accidentally forgot in the previous episode to show you guys the victory celebration of us winning the, the previous episode's final Michigan rally. So guys, we have gotten the win. Now you guys can see the quick celebration. That is a little bit of a blunder from my side. But once again, not the end of the world. We are continuing with our dirt career here today for episode number three. I've got no idea how many episodes this career mode's going to have because this game's got a big career, I'm not gonna lie. But still, I think, uh, let, let, no, I don't think. Let's just see what happens. Let's just see what happens. Guys, heading to, into this episode, you guys know that I really, really badly want to start my our, our own team. It's not my team, it's your guys' team as well. Our own team. We need to buy our first car so we can actually be in be able to start our team so there's a lot of work this episode but if anybody can do it with your support guys drop a like down below to give me a good luck for this episode we can have our first car come the end of this episode and i think it's going to be a better car than the r2 car enjoy the stage if we want to enter more prestigious comps we need to have a good reputation going in five four three two one, go. Break four through the gate, keep middle of the rest. Left five. Right six. And left five. Four to the street dip. Right six of the rest. Don't cut. Right five. Don't cut. And right four. Don't cut. Eight. Right four more. And right six. One hundred. Left six. Don't cut. And left four more. Two hundred. Left. Keep in, don't cut, 250. Right four long, keep in, don't cut, 60. Right five. And right four, 60. Right five, keep right of the crest, 60. Turn a cube left, 60. Crest, 200. 200 over bumps, 60. Right 6. And left 5. driver guys quickly just something don't tr trust me it's not just you guys who are sick of michigan it is me as well it seems all the rallies that you start off this career mode with are michigan rallies but the sooner we get them done the sooner they are out of the way so yes 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 we are moving on to the next stage it's a very short stage only 2.92 kilometers um guys i can't wait to get further on into this rally career look guys even though i'm not good at rally i love rallying and a long stage, when you complete it, you just feel so accomplished. And it's just so much fun because you are you are constantly at your max performance on the edge of grip, on the edge of everything. You are on the limit, which makes rally just so, so much fun. But guys, we're heading into stage two. It's a very short stage, not really any damage to the car. So not much to say except sit back and enjoy. Yeah. This stage recce went well, so... We should be in for a good run. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Crest 100.
So, well done. I also agree. That was a brilliant result. And guys, I think it's time. I think it's time. We've just banked this rally. The finances are looking beautiful. And I see no reason to go do a little bit of window shopping. And if we see something we like in the window, we go into the shop and we just get right the check and we give it to them. I know nobody in this modern day still writes checks, but I, that's a goal for me one day. So, 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 just, just, just live with it. I like checks. I like checks. Okay. Okay. So let, let, let's get this done. The objectives, once again, it is 3 out of 4, so 75% objectives achieved, so no complaints from my side. Guys, what do you guys think we need to go for? Obviously, we can't go for an R2 car, because that would just be keeping the boring going. Hey, we're already level 7, we are tenderfoot, and um, I think the next rally we will be level 8. Okay, we will definitely be level 8 after that jump. Championship complete. The, the sparks go on. It is a very good celebration for us. We've won this another Michigan rally. But in any case, let's head to the car lot and see what there is for sale. Guys, just a quick reminder to follow me on all my social medias. Facebook, Twitter, and the Instagram to never, never miss what's going on here on YouTube. Guys, I think the NR4 class is what we need to go for. Yep, we need to go for this. And guys... If you look at the two cars, the Mitsubishi is the one to buy. More power, lighter car, and cheaper. What more do you want? Let's bank it, baby. Yeah. Nice choice. This is a great car. Now you can enter into championships with your own team and earn a lot more recognition. Running your own team can be a challenge, but the rewards are much greater. The best part of having your own team is branding it with your choice of pattern and color. We'll apply the same branding to all your cars. You can come back to the branding and change the look of your team at any time. Guys, we've got our own team! Yes! Yes, 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 yes. Now, I think we need a spiffy name, Turbo Fox Speed. I think that's good enough. Now, let's get a pattern going for this beautiful Evo 10 Rally car. Ooh, that looks sweet. Ooh, that previous one looks nice. Uh, gee, that one is a little bit crazy. But yeah, let's get that one. I think that is the best idea. Guys, oh, colors. I think uh, uh, orange, black, and blue will be a, a, a good fit. Let's just see. Let's, let's play around a bit with the colors. And while you guys watch how I played around with the colors. Okay. So guys, after we've painted our car, which is going to take a while because I am very picky, we need to look at sponsors. Now I think at the beginning of the game you only get one sponsor, but you guys are going to see we've got facilities for our team that we can upgrade. And if we upgrade the facilities, we will be able to get more sponsors on the car. And you guys know, more sponsors, more sponsors means more money, more money means more cars, more cars means more championships and more driving. <laughs> Yes, so but what I do know is those facilities are highly expensive and they go from from grade E to grade A So it's E is your worst D C B and then the best is obviously A But you have to be a certain level to purchase certain I would say grades of the facilities so this is going to be very very interesting and um, uh, guys, one thing that I'm going to tell you guys is you start off with nothing basically. But I don't want to buy E stuff because first of all, like I said, the stuff are highly expensive. And there's no point in just buying the E stuff if you can just wait a few levels and buy the slightly more expensive D stuff. So I think I've got to save up money to get all the D stuff and just keep all the E stuff because E stuff to me, it's a waste of money and time. So, so we're going to... We're gonna, Bite on our tongues, push a little bit through, and then see where we're gonna go. Great way to bring in more cash to your team. Your skill behind the field has already attracted potential sponsors. Ryder Racing Suspension or LMX Media. I recommend you sign one up. Like other teams you can drive, sponsors will set you targets every event. Achieve the target to improve your relationship with us. 
and earn even more money or special rewards. Staff are integral to running a successful team. They'll repair your car, bring in sponsors, and help guide you on the track. I've pulled a few strings and found a PR agent, co-driver, and spotters to get you started. But it's up to you to hire a chief engineer. The chief engineer reviews damage and estimates how much time it will take to make repairs. They also make sure you have a balanced tuning setup for each event, but you can override this to suit your driving style. Staff have a range of skills to improve your team and take a small cut of your winnings from each event as payment. Some staff also have time-limited contracts. It's worth checking back often to ensure you're getting the most out of it. Later, you'll be able to buy facilities to expand and upgrade your team, allowing you to hire more engineers and operate more competitively. But for now, engineers are vital for repairing your car during an event. They can work together to complete repairs faster, saving time in the service area. Having a good PR agent is important to bring in new sponsors and better contracts. Your co-driver's job is to guide you during rally events by calling out turns and other hazards on the stage ahead, allowing you to anticipate what's coming next and drive as fast as you can. Spotters help guide you at Land Rush and Rally Cross events. Unlike a co-driver, they're not in the car with you. They'll be speaking to you over the radio from an observation tower near the track. Okay guys, finally we are through all those things. I will show you guys the facilities a bit later or maybe even next episode. Um, because we've taken a lot of time by buying our car, customizing it. And we still, I can't give you guys just a, two stages and then let the episode end. What, 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 that's boring. We need to test out this new car. We need to test out our new baby. We're taking it to Fitzroy, Australia. Uh, I don't, I don't have a good feeling about this. I think this car's got to come back with a few dents and a few scratches and uh, yeah. Because this suddenly, the complexity of the stages have gotten a lot harder. And this class, this car is a lot quicker than the Ford, the Ford Fiesta we've driven. Um, so it's going to be a challenge. It's going to be, I think the first two stages, I've just got to try and get used to the car, which is not going to be easy, but we're going to try our best. Guys, please be a boss. Go down below, hit the subscribe. Don't forget to ding the bell to never miss a future episode because if you miss episodes, you are just not right up top. Man, don't, don't do that. Get all the episodes in and feel good about yourself and have yourself entertained. It's good for the soul. <laughs> oh, I'm a weirdo. But in any case, guys, it's time for our first rally. With your own cars, guys, you can actually upgrade the car's parts. It also works like the facilities E, D, C, B, A, like letters. A obviously being the best, E obviously being the, the worst. This car is an all-rounded C, so we're starting off with a quite a good car, or is it D? I can't see there on my screen, it's a bit blurry, but I think you guys will know if it's a C. But um, guys, it's time. Let's have our first stage in our NR4 car. Yeah. All right, nothing from the marshal. It can only be a good thing. Five, four, three, two, one, go. Left. 
sarcasm <laughs> guys not the best first stage we did uh, bump the car a few times we did give it a little bit of a, of a spank when it came to driving a little bit too hard I didn't realize how much faster this this NR4 Mitsubishi is than the R2 Fiesta so I didn't expect the uh, the amount of speed and I did I overdid it a bit but like I said the first I think actually not just the first two stages this first rally in, in in a hole it's just going to be me getting used to this car because this car it's a lot more lively to drive which I enjoy don't get me wrong I enjoy it but it's now that I've gotten used to the Fiesta this is a whole new ball game so yeah this is going to be hard um, I think we are we are going well we are still in the lead of, of the rally at this uh, stage it's only a one one event rally with four stages so we have to stay ahead Hey, the car's in good shape. It, it just looks beat up. Gives it some character. Five, four, three, two, one, go. One ten, through dip. Keep left, over crest.
16, right 3 long, opens over crests, dip right 5, 80 through dip, left 3 over crest, dip crest, keep right over crest, 80, caution, crest, left 2, 16 through dip, keep left over crest, right 6, don't cut, right 4, don't cut, and left 3, and right 4, opens, don't cut, keep left, over crest, over finish. Okay, take it to the control. <laughs> Perfect, good job, well done. Guys, that stage went so much better. I actually liked our new female co-driver's comment at the beginning of the stage. A car with a few dents and bumps and scratches and stuff, it gives the car more character. But guys, that's the, all, all the time we have for today when it comes to driving. We will continue on this Fitzroy Australia rally when we return with episode number four. But for now, we just got to sit back a little bit and talk quickly. And guys, this new car... I can see that I'm going to enjoy this Mitsubishi a lot. Now, if you guys know me in the past, well, know me from past experience, I am a Subaru fanatic when it comes to rally. I love me some Subi, but Mitsubishi is also, they may build brilliant rally cars, and this one is a testimony of that. Um, it's got more power than the Subaru in its class, it's lighter, and they, they just this car just feels awesome to drive. I know I don't, I haven't driven the Subaru yet, but I think between the two, even though I haven't driven the Subaru yet, I think of the two I would, I would choose this car. And guys, just by the way, this car sounds absolutely phenomenal. Did you guys hear it when it idles? It's got like a little bit of a blurb every time like the engine kicks in. It's, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. And um, guys, Australia, yeah, it's a lot different from Michigan. Michigan is, it's, it's a lot more high speed. Um, not as technical. Australia is a lot more technical. You really have to be fr um, harsh on your brakes here in Australia because the corners can really, really easy, easily catch you out. You guys know with the Fiesta, I had a little bit of a big blunder the previous episode by, with um, me wanting to French kiss a tree. But um, I think in Australia for now we are fine. Stuff's still going good. And um, with our charismatic car, finishing the first two stages, obviously starting off the next episode by fixing the car. It's the middle of the rally, so we will have about 30 minutes to fix for everything that we ha have damaged. So I think next episode we will we'll go a bit better for the second half of the rally. And um, yeah, I hope you guys like my choice of vinyl on the car and my choice of color. But guys, that has been this episode. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for staying till the end. Please leave a like down below. It's only going to take you two seconds. Share this video with your friends. You guys are the word of mouth. You guys know my saying by now, by this time. And also, please subscribe down below. Ding the bell to never miss a future episode. And I'll see all of you epic people for episode four. This is going to be an awesome career. Cheers!